Welcome back to another episode on B-Hole Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at my collection of fighting games on the PlayStation Portable or the PSP. The PlayStation Portable isn't the best when it comes to fighting games. With any portable title, the controls always seem to give me heartache unlike a normal controller on a console. The D-pad would always give me grief with the moveset and start to really hurt my left thumb due to the stiff feel. This led to my collection being more of an RPG action adventure based system. However, there are some must haves on the system that I loved wherever I went. Vampire Chronicle The Chaos Tower was developed and released by Capcom in 2004 with the PSP's initial release and was a direct port from the Dreamcast Japan only fighter. Being my only Japanese game, I was so glad there was no region lock on the system. The game is one of the more smoother games to play with its slick and fast paced combos and relatively easy moveset that doesn't really rely too much on the D-pad but more on button combinations. Dragon Ball Z Shin Budokai Another Road was developed by Dimps and released by Atari in 2007. The game is a fighting game based on the Future Trunks alternate timeline revolving around the Majin Buu saga. This untold story has Trunks saving the world in this story arc and is extremely wordy and long and will make you skip to the fighting. The fighting is smooth and easy to do, with most combos done with one to two button presses. Crash. Samurai Showdown Anthology was developed by Terminal Reality and released by SNK Playmore in 2009. The game includes all of the 2D games in the series from 1 to 6 in one package. A great collection of one of the best weapon based fighting games of all time for the player to pick from. I do feel that like the controls were a bit delayed in the later iterations like Samurai Showdown 6 in comparison to Samurai Showdown 1 and 2. Still, a perfect way to play Samurai Showdown on the go. Street Fighter Alpha 3 Max was developed and released by Capcom in 2006. This version of Alpha 3 has the most complete roster of characters with 38 and is the one game that destroys my thumb with its precise gameplay. Very fun to still play on the go but can't play for too long as the stiff controls really become an issue after very long playthroughs. A really good old fashioned Street Fighter brawl but beware, controls are a bit stiff. That's it for me on this episode on my collection of fighting games on the PSP. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Be Hill out and Greg, take us out of here and I will see you all next upload.
Yeah.